It has been a journey to get to this point. Goober. Mm -hmm. Welcome back to my channel. Today is the like fifth time I've tried to film this. Not even kidding. I have a really massive headache right now. I don't really feel very well. So I just, but I did want to film this for you guys because I am not waiting for my last package, which was from Fashion Nova. We would be here till Christmas and I'm not about to do a Black Friday haul after Christmas. Therefore, we're doing it now. 2.30 in the afternoon. We are back in my bedroom because camera is dead and the room, the beauty room, extra room, whatever you want to call it, is very messy right now because I have Chris people's Christmas presents in there, boxes for Christmas decorations and the Christmas tree. I have the giveaway prize in there in a massive freaking box, not even kidding. And yeah, it's just messy. So we're in here. But today I'm giving you guys my Black Friday weekend haul, which was all purchased online for the most part. Oh, I forgot the other things, hold on. Now we have everything. <laughs> the day of Thanksgiving, I ended up purchasing the Jeffree Star mystery boxes, two of them, the biggest one and the medium size one, as well as one of the, his Extreme Frost he just came out with. But unfortunately, he's not shipping them until, wow, I gotta really like calm down for a second. <sighs> He is not going to be shipping those or he just started shipping them out like this week and I haven't received a shipping confirmation yet. Money wasn't taken out of my account yet. So therefore I don't have them here to show you yet. But when I do, I will do part of Vlogmas obviously. And I do have one order from Fashion Nova, hence why I am not shopping anymore because we're not doing hauls anymore because I ordered actually two bikinis for summer 2020 and then I ended up getting a little sweatshirt crop top that says baby girl and it's really cute. Not gonna haul, not gonna shop, try not to the best I can, but I'm definitely not doing hauls anymore for the time being. Yeah, that package isn't coming until like Christmas. So that's that, but I, again, I will show you guys that when I get it. I ended up going to Ulta and I ended up stocking up on on my favorite dry shampoo which is the Batiste dry shampoo by the way my hair is really awful and I need to tone it so if you're like oh my god Sam your hair is brassy I know it's brassy I have to tone it eight dry shampoos from Batiste I wanted to get the defrizzing one but they were out of it so I got the coconut and exotic tropical sweet and delicious sweetie we've got I think there's two cherry ones in here another sweetie because I love that scent we have the fresh one which smells really good lastly we have just an original one and we have this one I've never tried, the Fruity and Carefree Pink Pineapple, so hopefully, hopefully that smells good. I only stock up on these Black Friday because they're buy one, get one free. So, so this was the only time of the year I could get them for this price, and I was like, yeah, it's happening. Literally the only thing I went to Ulta for. I didn't really, I was going to buy some other things and decide to just get this because this was the most important. Okay, and then after that, David and I went into Bed Bath & Beyond just randomly. He had never been in there before and I haven't been in there since God, since Danielle and I were buying stuff for her dorm room for college and that was like a million years ago. So, okay, I'm gonna get all adult on you guys for a minute because these are my favorite sponges. Well, actually the Scrub Daddy is my favorite sponge of all time. I don't care. Call me a bougie I don't care. This is my favorite of all time. David actually really likes the Scrub Mommy because it has like an actual sponge on it. If you have these, you know. But the top is this kind of like squishy, like hard sponge that gets hard in cold water and it gets nice and flexible in hot water, which is why I love these and also that they really get your dishes clean. Like, oh my God. And I love that you can actually put these in the dishwasher to sanitize them, but I usually use one for about a month and then it gets all gross and crusty and then I throw it out and then I replace it with another one. But that's just me personally. I don't like to use a sponge for a long period of time because ugh, I just I have a lot of weird phobias If you guys want me to do a video about that, let me know below I've got a lot of weird things that bother me. I feel like I don't know but Those were actually a pretty good deal because it was like nine dollars for three of them And normally if you buy just one of them, it's like five bucks alone, which is like insane So any multi-packs i'm all down for the other two things I ended up buying were a couple of yankee candles because they were two for 35 or one for 25 So I was like, you know what spend 10 bucks more and get two. So I got Christmas cookie. Oh my gosh, so good. I do have to be careful about burning candles though because I think some of them do aggravate Gooby because she did get sick on our bedding on Thanksgiving. And I think a lot of it is because one of the candles, but this is what this one looks like. I'm sorry about the lighting. I just don't, I'm lazy today. So lazy life. Then the other one I got is called After Sledding from the Mountain Holiday Collection. Oh my gosh, it smells really good. It has like spice and like shortbread in there. Like, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. This is gonna be, this is like my main home home candle like literally when we move to Maine this will be in the living room burning around Christmas time with snowing outside and I'm staying home with the animals animal there will be more though 
Then the next few things are from Target. So all these things I ended up getting actually, I believe the weekend after my birthday before I went back to work. So they're all really random, but all things I really wanted. Call me a weirdo, I know. Again, call me an adult, but I really wanted this little mini waffle maker for so long and I love waffles. I honestly feel like I'm, I really have been wanting this for a long time and it was $9.99, but I think it was on sale for like $7. So I was like, you know what? This cute little mint baby is gonna coming in my life with my KitchenAid mixer. No one's with. So this, like, I'm so excited to use this and make little waffles and just make, oh, like be all cute and stuff. And then I picked up the Starbucks Holiday Blend 2019 coffee because I always love the Holiday Blend. It just has like a zing to it, like a like, kick. It's like different than Pike Place, but like, for me, like slightly, it has like a, a zing to it that I really, really enjoy. So I ended up picking that up. And then I got a couple cups. One is another mug. I don't need any more mugs. David will literally end me if I buy any more mugs. But I did have to get this one because it was so cute. It says, it's beginning to look a lot like coffee. With like little, supposed to be snowflakes around it, which I think is really adorable and cute. And then I think this is supposed to be, oh yeah, double wall stainless steel vacuum wine tumbler, which I scratched this already. Love that for me. I'm not really a wine person. I feel like I might start to become one because I do like to mix wine with juice or something because I just can't drink wine by itself. I just think it's nasty. I had to get this. I've been wanting it for so long. I blame Instagram. It says I do marathons at Target. I've been wanting this for so long. I blame Instagram 100%. Instagram is the reason why I buy I shop a lot at Target because I see things on the Target pages and I'm like, oh my god. And then I add it to my collection and I wait and wait for like a sale or my birthday or something. And then I end up buying or I just accumulate. I'm just, uh, see, again, more reasons why we're not hauling anymore. <laughs> Anyways, the last thing I ended up getting was this tank top. It's just a dark gray racerback tank top in a size large. I love these from Universal Thread. I think they're very comfortable and really cute. And I'm always in tank tops when I'm not like trying to be trendy and cute or trying to be comfy. Like I just always love tank tops. Four things I recently got from Target this past Black Friday weekend were these really really okay this screams high school vibes for me like if I feel like when I was a sophomore in high school and I was 16 everyone had these these were the trendy like oh my gosh and now they're back and I bought a pair oh my god I have to get these these are from stars above they are like a pair of like slippers but these are like slip on like all the girls were wearing like we just throw them out with our leggings and go to school like we didn't care especially the days we didn't care and I had a brown pair and I love them so much so I had to get this little gray pair they were on sale and I'm just so happy that I did because they're just so cute and they're comfy and I could throw them on and leave the house and not worry about it just oh nostalgia there's a lot of nostalgia in this haul i ended up getting this little sherpa sweatshirt because i really love the one that david got me that little camo one so i ended up getting the lime green one which i just thought was really really cute this is a size 2x because i'm crazy and i just like to things to be like like this to be really baggy on me and stuff it's so cute it has a little hood and it has a little tie string at the bottom keep you nice and comfy and cute and also be trendy for instagram or whatever and then I also got a not matching pair but the same kind of sweatpants because again I'm a sweatpants fiend it's a thing now I got them in XL so they could be extra comfy they're just black and adorable okay and then and then and then and then uh, this pack actually I ordered this the day of my birthday and it didn't come and it got lost so again as I've said in my last haul I had to cancel the order and reorder it Target sometimes hates me I don't I don't understand why it's really cute bralette it's just so so adorable and it's black and you can just throw it on and wear it although I feel like it's not it's gonna be too big but maybe not because I do have big you know tatas I just thought it was really cute and I love to wear stuff like this just like by itself you know for your special someone or just like under clothes or in the summertime these are really nice to just throw on with a loose tank top and just forget about it I also had to get another Christmas shirt because my mean girls one I've had for so long that says more for you Glen Coco you go Glen Coco you guys have probably seen me wear on Instagram all the time during this time of year i had to get this one because it says have yourself a merry little cocktail because this is the time of year to enjoy ourselves and have a lot of cocktails <laughs> site i ordered from was fanjoy because there was a lot of youtuber merch that i have been eyeing for probably over the whole entire year and i usually don't order anything from fanjoy unless it's like a sale or something like that because their merch honestly expansive so the first thing i ended up getting were the tana scandalous underwear and I'm not going to show you guys because I think you know you already got the gist it's just underwear but I thought it was cute and I've been wanting it for a while and then along with that I 
I ended up getting this one because honestly I saw Tana wear this and I thought that her boobs look so good in it like without a bra like just her boobs and I was like oh my gosh that looks so good on her I was like oh my gosh she looks amazing so I ended up getting the same tank top and just says daddy's rich <laughs> I could just hear the comments now. Oh my God, you're 27 and you're married. And man, 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 this, this is the day you work with children. Why aren't you buying things like that? Because when I'm not working with kids, I'm a boss ass. Mm, mm. Mm, totally kidding. Next thing I got was also from her little scandalous line full sports bra and I got the matching leggings because I just thought they were so so cute. Although I think this is gonna be way too small for me because my boobs are just gonna fall right out of this. How much you want to bet? How much you want to bet? Because I did not do very good with judging sizes. And these are what the leggings look like with scandalous all along the top. And I already know this is gonna show off my puff and I'm not really excited about it. But you know what? They're cute. I cute. And I could probably just throw them on to wear on the weekend or something over throw a sweatshirt over it and not even give a crap. Last couple things are actually from Amanda Ensing's merch, which I've never watched her a day in my life. I just really like her merch. Like, call me a weirdo. But she put out these a couple things that said this, so I had to get it because it's like so true and it was cute. It says, be as dedicated to your goals as you are to your Instagram feed, which is so true because like, fuck Instagram for a minute. It's fun and all and I love posting on there, don't get me wrong, but you know, goals, goals. That's what it's all about in 2020, you guys. Like, all my goals. We're gonna do it. And then finally, I've been eyeing this hoodie since she put it out last year and I wanted it and it was on sale so I got it and it's just the hoodie that says the makeup life I have the tank top her tank top that says the makeup life and it's just so cute and comfy and it looks like it's gonna be massive which is awesome because I love it when pullover hoodies are really really big and massive I don't like when they're tight like I don't it depends on the day like, things are actually from H&M from Ariana Grande's merch line that she has partnered with them they were on sale I ended up getting a couple things because I actually wanted this sweatshirt so freaking bad because just again Ari has just been like my like my spirit animal this year like she's just like thank you next like the whole thing as I've talked about before if you've seen my Spotify wrapped I posted on my Instagram story there's no doubt like Ari has been my artist of the year like I'm obsessed I love her so I ended up getting her Thank you next cropped sweatshirt that has a little tie at the bottom and these were on sale so these both together ended up being 30 and normally this would have just been 30 and that would have been like 17 so I'm so excited about that just says thank you next and it says Ariana Grande on the back and for shirts that's the seven rings shirt which is really really cute so it just looks like that and again it just says Ariana Grande on the back and I already have her like break up with your girlfriend shirt too which I think is really funny okay so next we're gonna go into things I bought from Victoria's Secret first couple things I'm gonna show you guys are the free items that I got because I spent over $150 I know I know but I ended up getting this tote and the only reason I wanted it was because it was actually like different it was kind of simple but it just says like pink all over it with hearts and the litter pink. and it actually like has a zipper on it and everything so I thought this would be really cute and to especially be my next to work bag that I could just take to work and be a little bit more inconspicuous because I'm using my sequin Victoria's Secret Black Friday bag from like years ago and I just feel like everyone's like oh my god Sam's here because the sequins like shining on the bag I don't know I'm just weird then I also got the blanket again since I spent 150 oh it has a little pink like patch on it that's cute like a very soft blanket oh my gosh I love this I think this is definitely gonna be like on my couch because it's just like it's that I don't even know what you call this plaid print it's the red plaid print that everyone loves I don't know what it's really called this is definitely gonna go on my couch because I feel like it should just be a nice couch blanket to throw on and snuggle okay and as for everything else got the $25 Sherpa pullover which feels it's like really nice quality for being $25 to be honest and it just has a little zipper on there all that kind of stuff and this is definitely gonna be something I'm gonna wear to work and like not care because it's just so comfy and warm I'm very excited about that it also has a nice hood in the back too and I ended up getting the fleece line leggings I think these were also 25 or they were 20 but they're nice and fleece on the inside they have a band that's hopefully gonna keep my puff in because you guys know how I feel about that and they feel really nice so I'm literally feeling myself getting sick as I film it's so fun and then I ended up getting the ten dollar t-shirt which at first i was like why did i buy this but now i'm like 90s vibes literally so i got this black t-shirt that has a heart of roses and it says love pink and china shirts my mom used to make me wear to school when i was little like it's just really cute it's their accessories or buy one get one free and i haven't really been into beanies and i really want to start wearing beanies more so i ended up getting i got this nice neon hot pink 
beanie which I think is gonna be really adorable and cute just to like throw on and wear and not care because I used to love wearing beanies all the time and now I don't so I got this one and I got this like hot neon green one which I think is really cute too the last couple things in here I got another bra but I didn't mean for it to be a push-up bra so whatever we're just gonna deal with it I guess very sexy push-up bra and it's with that iconic like Swarovski or crystal whatever crystal straps on there that I have been wanting for a while decided to get it because it was on sale it was cheaper than original price because it was on sale so it just says Victoria's Secret with the straps and I just thought it was really really cute and I do need new bras fun fact all my bras are getting really crazy and dingy straps are falling down all the time and like they're not staying up like this one I'm wearing now so I ended up getting a bra and then I un ended up actually getting one of the bling panties as well it's a very scandalous and again it just has the little crystals on the side that say victoria's secret and just cute to wear for you know be cute to wear for my husband that's all i'm gonna say and the last few things i ended up getting were from amazon you guys saw that one of my friends mel my old co-teacher that's who she is got me an amazon gift card for my birthday so i went a little amazon crazy on thanksgiving i just got a few little things this is all stuff that was on my wish list for a long time so i was like okay this little watermelon keychain because it was just really adorable and cute and i just decided to buy it it was the time to get it and then i also got this is obviously a knockoff like obviously a knockoff but if you guys have been watching my vlogmas i have been personally talking about starting my journaling again and wanting to journal more so i actually ended up getting this knockoff ariana grande journal that says thank you next even though it's not it's not ariana like it's not her licensing or anything it's just a normal journal inside but it says thank you next like from the burn book from her uh, music video and i thought it was really cute so i ended up picking that up as my next journal when I'm done with my watermelon one and then I ended up getting one like I want to do like buy more like Amazon clothes is that weird I just do I don't know I bought Amazon clothes in the past and I really love them a lot and underwear I just I don't know I wanted to buy more so I got a cami tank top with the brand is active basic and mine's in an XL because I just wanted to test it out and we'll see how this cami fits on me again very picky with camis I just got rid of so many I'm just why nobody cares nobody cares why do I say this shit nobody cares <laughs> and the last thing now last year around this time I think last January I actually got two fuzzy like pullover sweatshirts but I thought it was like a jacket like this and I still love them don't really wear them that much anymore but I still love them and I have been wanting a jacket like this for a while I do have one from Target that I really love and you guys have seen me wear and I've hauled that has like the little pocket and it's gray and it's really cute but it wasn't completely what I really wanted. I ended up getting this one off of Amazon. It's by the brand Chols. Chol Choi Eyes. Tolls. I don't know how to say this. It says the ultimate fashion fix. And this is an XL. It's cute. And I know this is going to get dirty. So everyone out there is going to be like, oh my God, Sam, it's going to get so dirty. I ended up getting this white Sherpa jacket. It's actually not as thick and heavy as my Target one, but it's just really adorable. And I just saw it and I was like, oh my God, white. Again, it could end up being bad. It could end up being like how every time I buy something white and I don't like it because it makes me look bigger and just i don't know i don't know we're just gonna see we're just gonna see but i just i just love wearing jackets and i just thought it was so cute and just like low key to throw on and like go out and just like be cute and whatever this would have been perfect to wear last night i don't know why i don't i've lately not been liking to buy like if i haul like save things for a haul i like, don't touch it until i haul it like i used to do that all the time and i stopped and now i'm doing it again i don't know other reasons why we're not hauling anymore <laughs> so but that was basically everything that i got black friday weekend thanksgiving day all online shopping for the most part yeah no makeup notice no makeup because i have enough like i'm over it i love you guys so much hope you have an awesome day subscribe if you would like to see more of me like this video if you enjoy turn on bell post notifications so you know when i post a new video and i will see you guys tomorrow for vlogmas day i don't know because i don't know when i'm posting this yet but i love you guys